Hey guys, a very tired Tim coming over here from Playboy Video Games over in Benjamin, Texas. Uh, just <laughs> going over some weekend trades real quickly. Uh, let's try and make this nice and quick because I, I, I'm i just exhausted. <laughs> anyway, uh, let's go ahead and start right here. Uh, Deadpool, uh, I know Deadpool's kind of shot up in popularity. Gee, I wonder why. <laughs> um, but we do have the PS3 copy in right now. Uh, so that's, you know, that'll sell like hotcakes, I'm sure. Uh, but we got some pretty solid PS3 games here. Uh, God of War 3, uh, Marvel's, uh, Marvel Ultimate Alliance 2. I was about to say Marvel vs. Capcom. Ooh. Uh, Army of Two. I know a lot of people have been looking for that. Mm -hmm. Are those games for uh, about the past year or so? Kind of regained popularity. Uh, FIFA Street 3. We actually never really see any FIFA Street games come in, so that's nice a little bit. Uh, Cuphead for PS4. Uh, this one actually does have some goodies to it as well. Uh, Dragon Quest XI, I really enjoyed that game. Uh, that's more up to my speed. Uh, good old Doom. We can never have too many copies of Doom. Uh, FF Type Zero. Yeah, that's not bad. Uh, let me see here. Uh, oh, uh, probably uh, surprisingly one of the more higher dollar ones in here. Uh, America's game, Wheel of Fortune and Jeopardy. Uh, <laughs> nice. Yeah, I'm just saying. Uh, and uh, Ground Zeroes, a nice little demo for uh, uh, Five and what would become, uh, well, what would set up Five, I should say. Anyways, so let's go ahead. Let's go over some of the uh, Super Nintendo games here real quick. Uh, we got Strike Gunner STG, which we haven't had that one in a very long time, so that's nice seeing that mm -hmm. one. Uh, Alliant King, a Mario All-Stars, and Mario World combined together. Uh, Link to the Past, a Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, uh, a Mo <laughs> the uh, <laughs> notorious Switch version of Mortal Kombat 1. Yeah. Uh, Rust for Xbox One, which I actually never knew they did a, a physical copy of it, but lo and behold here it is uh let's see we got armored core 2 for playstation 2 uh and uh we got red ninja for our original xbox uh the cover is a reproduction though full disclosure on that one uh but that's yeah, it's an interesting game to say the least uh so let's go over to the wii stack it's, the Wii Stack is well, pretty stacked, let's be fair. Uh, we got Wii Sports and Wii Sports Resort combined uh, with the original case. Uh, let's see, we got Mario Galaxy, Twilight Princess, Mario Super Sluggers, which quite a few people have been asking about that one lately. Mm -hmm. I guess because baseball season. But uh, Pokemon Battle Revolution, Mario All-Stars, The Skyward Sword, Return to Dreamland. Uh, the Dream Collection Special Edition, it just Who's doesn't... that one? Can we look at the back? Yeah, of course. I think it's like... Basically, almost all the Kirby yeah. games, for the most part. Oh, yeah. Wow. Dreamland Adventure, Dreamland Two, Superstar, Dreamland Three, and Crystal Shards. Yeah, can't yeah, pass so that's that. Yeah, so that's literally like the first six games. So that's mm -hmm. that's pretty solid, right yeah. there, guys. Yeah, it doesn't have the uh, art book or the uh, 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 whole package or anything like that with it, but I believe it does. Yeah, it does have the CD. So that's nice. Mm -hmm. Let's see here. Mario Kart Wii. Well, that won't be here for too long. Give us a call. We can hold that for you. Uh, New Super Mario Bros. U, which actually we don't really see often much anymore, mm -hmm. surprisingly. Uh, Star Fox Adventure. I'm kind of debating on grabbing that one myself. <laughs> uh, Mario Party 5. Uh, Mario Parties have been coming in and out of stock, so if you guys are interested in that one, I would definitely... Give us a call, we can hold it for you. Uh, Dragon's Lair 3D, we don't really see that one too often either. Uh, Metro Prime 2, Zelda Collector's Edition, so, yeah, it's a pretty, mm -hmm. pretty solid, pretty solid amount of uh, GameCube games there. Uh, and speaking of GameCube, we also have a little disc holder That's as cute. well. Yeah, exactly, just, just pop them right on in. Not too shabby. I have no clue what on earth I'm gonna price that at. Anyways. Uh, N64 games, uh, we got stuff, Battle Tanks, Extreme G, which I really enjoy that game. It's a, it's a great not, uh, not F-Zero. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it is good. It is good. Uh, Mario 64, Kart, Cruising USA, GoldenEye. Actually, this might be like one of the better looking GoldenEye covers you've had in a very long it's time. Actually, that is hard to come by, yeah. It really is. Like, I think it's almost, almost pristine. Uh... Diddy, uh, Star Fox, Turok, Shadows of the Empire with, oh my god, what was this guy's name? Dash Randar, I think. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what a great name. Uh, and Killer Instinct Gold. Ooh, not too shabby, not too shabby. Uh, but, uh, 
we did get in a 2DS. I know people are looking for a 3DS, but hey, this plays 3DS games at mm -hmm. least. It's not that bad, guys. It's pretty good. Uh, some DS lights at least. Some, and well, I think both of them are in a pretty darn good shape, so that's nice because I know we've been kind of hurting on DS's for a while. Uh, got a few Wii's in at least. Uh, at least one of them's GameCube backwards. I don't think these two are. Uh, we got a black GameCube in at least. Hit the open button. Ooh, oh, you I got like it. That. Just gotta, ooh, just gotta hear that every <laughs> once in a while. Just like for the uh, PlayStation. Nice. Yeah, that's not bad. Got a 360. Uh, got a uh, Super Nintendo. Uh, got a dirty ooh. N64. We're gonna have to clean up, but uh, no whammies, no whammies. Oh, oh. man. That's lame. Uh, but surprisingly, got another Guitar Hero 2, uh, PlayStation 2 guitar. Nice. Yeah. So the uh, fact that we have two of them right now in stock is honestly kind of mind blowing. And that'll <laughs> go quick. It will go quick, guys. So, yeah. But if anything that you see up here seems interesting to you, give us a call 281 992 4263. Pretty sure that's right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 281 G A M E, in other words. Uh, give us a call. We can hold stuff for you until the end of the day, or you could just give us a call. Just ask us what else we have in stock. Uh, but yeah, it's, we're open every day of the week. So, guys, come on down to Player One in Friendswood. It'll be a great time.